Once just you've decided you want to tilt your portfolio to some riskier asset class, you're left with the decision of how much to tilt it. The more you tilt, the more theoretical return you will get, but you have to weigh that against the loss of diversification and the additional risk. The reason small stocks have a higher expected return is that the risk is higher, that they may not get that expected return, even in the long run. It's a bit of a catch-22, so I suggest moderation in all things. Though some authorities have advocated put all of your stock allocation into risky asset classes such as small value stocks, I recommend you keep your tilt small enough that you still have a significant chunk of your portfolio invested in all the stocks in the world and all the investment grade bonds in your currency. My dad, your host, Dr. Dahl, is a practicing emergency physician, blogger, author, and podcaster. He is not a licensed accountant, attorney, or financial advisor, so this podcast is for your entertainment and information only and should not be considered official, personalized financial advice.